Yo, YouTube, what do you do? It's your boy, Candle the Sports Talk TV, back in with another video, man. Um, today, we finna talk about um, Damian Lillard and um, him signing his um, two-year extension with the Blazers to remain, you know, with the Blazers um, and take shots at LeBron James, Kevin Durant, Paul George, all these guys that's teaming up, you know. To um, form a super team, quote unquote. But you know, Dane had something to say. Through you know, you through you through his little shots. At though um, LeBron James and those guys, and it was kind of interesting because uh, you know all the reports, some reports was coming out that Dane. Um, May not be, um, may, may be looking to get out of Portland, um, you know, because of management. Um, it's kind of interesting. Um, my thoughts on it, I want to say that uh, I kind of get where Dame is coming from to a certain extent, but you have to realize that guys are doing what's best for their career. If that's changing teams, going to form with other stars, and hey, so be it. Like, nobody in this league, or rarely in this league, have um, players, teams, have, have um, they haven't been able to win without at least one or two stars anyways. So, I don't get, you know, the... Um, criticism that a lot of players get for going up and teaming up, you know, with other guys. It ain't, and people try to seem like super teams, you know, just started when LeBron, you know, LeBron James, they say LeBron James started the super team, bro. Super team's been here. Like, it's just even, whether it was through the draft, people drafting people, or drafting players, or, you know, players just coming to um, just team up with other players. You know, uh, it's crazy. These the players now have the power to play what the hell they want to play. I don't get why people is mad at that, but they'll complain about the owners and shit. Um, you know, the owners and everything uh, fucking over them. Or um, they'll say um, things like this. Oh, well, I think you should be getting paid more. Or, you know what I'm saying? Just like little shit. Like, what? Like, you, you think you should get paid more? You think you should be loyal when the organization ain't, is not loyal to him? They'll trade him during the game. You know, we seen Harrison Barnes get traded during the game. And when he was with the Warriors, get traded to the King during the game. I know he's not a big name. He's not a star in this league, but it still matters. Like, he don't franchise guys like that, the lowest tier guys, um, these are. Um, organizations or staffs ain't loyal to them guys. So you, what, what make you think you know the star player is gonna be loyal to the franchise if they ain't even loyal? Like I don't get it. Like and Dame is, I guess he's trying to prove a point that he don't need nobody. You know, to team up with. He can try to get good in on his own. Um, yeah, hey, I see where you're coming from, but don't take shots, there, dude. Especially dudes that are proven in, um, dudes like LeBron James, uh, you know, LeBron James is arguably still, even, you can say what you want, he's still arguably top three of all, top two of all time, of him doing that, so, you can say what you want, and most players have played with more talent than LeBron, now LeBron has played with some 
you know, great players, Hall of Famers type players. But you can say that about a lot of guys that you want to compare to LeBron James. You can say that about a lot of dudes who play with, you know, a lot of talent and Hall of Famers, multiple Hall of Famers. You know, LeBron James ain't the only one that who just did that. He's just made. He just made it. He just did it in a way that benefited him, and that's why people don't like that. And I want. I realize that people who think like that are the people who um, they get fucked over at their jobs. You know, LeBron is thinking of. LeBron is is. He's thinking in a boss type mindset. Even though he's working for the NBA, he's thinking he still is a boss. Like, you know, he got his own everything, you know, on show, on, you know, podcast or whatever. Uh, or not podcast, but, you know, y'all know what I'm trying to say. Like, un uninterrupted. Like, LeBron's is over that. Uh huh. Uh, so LeBron just got it. You know, LeBron just got his own everything, bro. Like, LeBron's a billionaire. So, LeBron is, is LeBron mindset is going to be different than you clowns that don't think that, you know, that thing that all LeBron James should be doing this and should be doing that. Of course, you're going to say that because you're not on the level of LeBron James. And you're not... Sorry to say this, if anybody get offended, you're not making the money that LeBron James is making. And you're not on the level, you like the status wise, like real, real popular type. Shit. Um, but yeah, like all these dudes that have something to say about LeBron James doing this, doing that, and those are the same people It's on a nine to five job, slaving. And ain't nothing wrong with that, but you just got to call it how it is. <laughs> I mean, we're going to keep it a buck. You used to just have something to say because it's LeBron James. And LeBron James is the first player to ever do all of this in history. And the first player to become a billionaire while actively playing. So I can see why LeBron James get gets a lot of hate. It ain't really it ain't strictly because of his basket. It ain't like if you think about it, it ain't really strictly because of what LeBron James is talent. It ain't really because of his talent. Like LeBron James LeBron James get more hate because of shit he did business wise and shit that benefited him and his family. That's why he's successful and that's why a lot of people are in the position that they are not because they they are always um you know think that people should do what they think that that person should do and that's not how a lot of works and but back to the um topic in here Damian Lillard Damian Lillard if staying in Portland is best for you dude then hey so be it you, you didn't did some things that, that in his lead. Now, do I think he should have made top 75? Oh, hell no. I think a plethora or a lot of players that's playing now should have made the top 75 over Dame. But that's just my opinion. I don't think Dame is proven enough to make even be in the top 75. But, hey, that's just my humble opinion. You know, um. Uh, but yeah, look, look, if you're going to hate on LeBron James or throw shots at dudes, bro, you know, like, I did, this is my thing about people, like, say it to this man's face, like, if you're going to be direct, no, Damian Lillard, he did say that to Paul George, he, he, he said it to Paul George's face that, you know, you dudes got to gotta jump ship, but I don't think Damian Lillard would say that to LeBron's face. Cause LeBron is just, he's just, 
He know how he know who LeBron is. He know, you know, LeBron has been successful doing it. A lot of dudes ain't even been successful doing it, doing what LeBron James has been doing. <laughs> and they've been trying so hard to do it that they still fail. Now that just doesn't mean that they um that it doesn't mean they can overcome it. Can't overcome it. Yes, they can overcome it, but hey, it's LeBron James. It's a different type of cat. So Damon Lillard, why you around here? Just cause you stayed in Portland. Who by the way, I don't even think uh I think at some point in time, if Damon, then your Damon, Damon Lillard's career, then you're going to be out of Portland. That's just my, I don't think he, he may retire a Portland Trailblazer, but I don't think he's going to be in Portland for that long anyway. So that's just what I had on this, man. Like, Damon Lillard, do you, hey, if you, you want to keep doing what you're doing, Portland, like, you'll be a legend in Portland. Whether you win the championship or not, you'll be remembered in Portland. But that's all you'll be remembered for. You won't be a member for an all-time great, um, you know, all-time great. you just be a, another dude that came in the lead that can put the ball in the hole. And there's plenty of guys who can do that. There's plenty of guys who's going to be able to do that um, after you, way after you. So we just have to... Um, we just have to um, realize that as fans and Damian Lillard as a man has to realize the level that he that he's on in the playing field that he's on. Like we nobody want you to like we don't honestly care, Dame. We people want you to leave, but hey, if you're fine with being loyal to that franchise, we ain't loyal to you as you think they are. And hey, that's your that's your that's your decision. You have to deal with that. But hey, y'all make sure y'all that like button, subscribe, share this video. Um, and I'm out.